Hey, welcome to Graphic Policy Television GPTV. I got a review of a comic that debuted this week in comic shops. This is Science Comics The Brain from First Second. Now, First Second's been doing tons of science comics for, uh, it feels like, years at this point. You can basically uh, cover everything from the deepest depths of the ocean to the furthest galaxies in space. Just tons of topics that you could ever want. It's pretty awesome. Uh, education in comic form. It's uh, you know educational comics. I find it fascinating to see uh, how you can use graphic novels and comics to teach people. So science comics, the brain is obviously about the brain. It's everything from how did it evolve to how does it function. Uh, things like memory to synapses to cells. It just covers everything, uh, and it is feels very in-depth. I'm going to assume that it is all correct because I don't know any of this stuff. I probably learned it at some point in my life and have since forgotten it. Uh, but what's fun is it teaches you in a way through story, uh, and this is uh, a character named Fahama has been kidnapped by a mad scientist and his zombie assistant who wants to steal her brain. We don't really know why she, they want to steal her brain, we just kind of roll with it. And through that she basically gets them to teach her about the brain and teach us, the readers, about the brain. And, uh, yeah, so it's it's from Tori Wolcott, Wolcott and Alex Grodens. And honestly, like, I love it. Like, this is a great way to go and teach pretty much anyone about whatever topics that you want. I mean, there is stuff in this I don't remember. I don't remember learning. I definitely uh, read it through and will have to read it through again as it teaches you the best way to learn things is from repetition repetition and then going and going over and over and over again this is in depth this is really really in depth uh and the books depending on the subject can vary in how in depth they are my big thing with this and it's not really knock is i'm not necessarily 100 percent sure what age level this would be for um just because of the topic and the stuff that's mentioned you know obviously if a kid's really interested in the brain and wants to learn how to do it this would be a great thing to go and give them, uh, but I don't know how much maybe a kid would totally understand it. I mean, it goes in depth, and it uses a lot of scientific uh, uh, information and terminology, and um, yeah, like it's this is this is a pretty this is a pretty crazy one. I imagine these are things that you learn in like biology in college to become a doctor. That's what it kind of feels like at points. Uh, it's not a bad thing at all because that's educational, uh, but it's one of those like. You know, it, it it's pretty it seems to be pretty solid and on top of things so uh that would be my only thing like i just don't necessarily know who who would really totally dig this and that's not necessarily a bad thing it's just yeah um the story is really really cute i mean basically uh fahama gets kidnapped while they're having a contest to try to sell cookies for like a girl scouts knockoff uh and then she goes and gets taken by this weird mad scientist in her brain uh, you'll see in a picture, and it takes her through kind of all this educational stuff. That's the mad scientist in the jar with the brain, and uh, yeah, that that's kind of generally so like it sums up the art. Uh, it has some fun with it. It really plays through stuff, uh, you know. So there's a little bit of story of her being kidnapped, but you know, for the most part, it's just an in-depth look at the brain and how it functions, and then how it evolved into what it is. So. Uh, basically, if you got a kid that wants to learn about the brain, this is this would be a good thing to put in front of them so they can learn. And then you don't have to explain it. And then they can read this and then they'll probably read it again to try to understand it all. Uh, this is out now. It's in comic shops. So you can go get it. And I think it should be in bookstores now as well. Uh, it retails for twelve ninety nine. We're not not that expensive at all. It's just again great educational tool, uh, great educational book to uh, give kids to learn. Uh, you can go obviously go get this in comic shops. Always go support your comic shop first and foremost. We always love uh, the concept of, of comics and education, so it's great to see more and more of this. And First Second has tons of these uh, on a whole range of topics. Bats, flying machines, plagues, dogs, coral reefs, dinosaurs, sharks, robots and drones, rockets, trees, and much more to come. So if you want this, go hit up your comic shop and uh, get it there. If they don't have it, they can always order it. Go support your local comic shop. They're the backbone of the industry. We've got a link beneath this video. You can put in your zip code. It'll tell you if your shop is uh, if there's a shop near you. If there's no shop near you, we do have affiliate links where you can go purchase them digitally. You get it physically. You get a bunch of options. Uh, but yeah, by doing that, like it is an affiliate link. We do get a small percentage of that. You support us. 
Speaking of support, I want to thank for a second for hooking us up with a review copy. We always appreciate their support. And then thank you for watching. Again, comics are blowing up on the educational field. There's tons of resources out there. Uh, comic books that can uh, educate you on a whole host of topics. History, science, math. There's, there's all kinds of crazy stuff. So go check it out. It's a great way to learn. Uh, if you're into graphic novels, if you're into comic books, you check us out every single day at graphicpolicy.com. We're on Twitter, Facebook, YouTube, Tumblr, all at Graphic Policy. Until next time, keep reading those comics and keep it geeky. Hey, thanks for watching the previous video from Graphic Policy Television. Just by watching, you help support our site. Thank you so much. Now, if you're watching these videos, you probably care about geeky things like movies, television, comic books, toys, games, video games, you name it. You can go and subscribe right now to our YouTube channel to stay in touch and catch all the new videos, or check out our website at graphicpolicy.com. There's a nice link on this end of the video. But as always, thank you for watching. Keep on rocking and keep it geeky.